Good afternoon, everybody. Matt M. Roy here again. Well, I think most of you know that I have two Power Mac G5s. I have one 1 1.6 gigahertz single processor, and then I got this one. This is a dual 1.8 gigahertz Power PC G5. Currently, it has two gigabytes of memory in it. Well, today, I am gonna fix that problem. I purchased these two one gigabyte crucial memory sticks at Office Max today for $54.99 on sale. Uh, they are one gigabyte DDR PC3200 sticks. When you're working with a Mac, if you're not going to buy their specific RAM, the best you can do is go out and buy Crucial. Crucial makes the memory at their factory and it is the best you can buy. All right, well, let's get started. First thing you got to do is take off the side panel. And there's just a little latch here, and it pulls right down. Secondly, you have this little air guard. This, you just grab the handle and pull back. Now the third part is the front fan assembly. This helps bring cool air in from the front of the unit. This right here, you just grab with one hand and pull out ever so slightly. You may have to wiggle it a little bit. And there you go. Now, in an early dual processor G5, the max amount of memory you can put in it is 4 gigabytes. You have four RAM slots, and as you can see, two of them are used at the moment. Those are housing my two one gigabyte crucial sticks. And now, time to install the new RAM. course you got to make sure you cut these things open. If you just try to do it with your hands, you will get hurt. I can almost promise you that. <laughs> Best thing to do, cut the top off. Take two hands and pull. Sometimes you have to get it started. Just like that, one, and then two, then you can take the stick right out. And there are the two one gigabyte crucial sticks. Now, to install this memory in, make sure both of the separators are out. And as a guide, you can line up, if it's the same type of memory, you can line up the old sticker on the RAM that's currently installed with the new sticker. That way you know you're putting it in properly. There's one. And once you hear them click in, you know you're good to go. We go ahead and put the fan assembly back in. Just line up the grooves and push ever so slightly, not to push too hard. Air guard goes back in. And finally, the cover. Push that in, push the lock down. All right, and now it's all installed and everything's back in place. Let's go ahead and boot it up and make sure it worked.
and there we are dual 1.8 giger power pc g5 and now four gigabytes of ddr sd ram now if anybody has any questions about how to do this uh... please comment on the video i will be doing some more upgrades on my g5s probably within the next couple months so stay tuned everybody